So y'all, in this video, I'm gonna be breaking down the, the two styles of game. What you doing, and nigga, what I'm doing. Okay, so we gonna go ahead and go into that. So, throw in the intro. What the hell? Tree to the left. Now I gotta scroll on my phone just to the left. Just a little slight turn. We do it all day. Little Google lady, you know I hate you, but I ain't gonna talk about you. No. Alright, what's going on, y'all? So, this is uh, Cameron McCullough, aka Master Teacher of Attraction. You know what I'm saying? And in this video, I'm here to uh, reveal another layer of game. This is more advanced. You know what I'm saying? To what you're probably used to. So, I'm going to just go ahead and try to break it down as much as I can. So, you can uh, understand what I'm saying. Okay? So, basically... There's two styles of game that you're going to come across. Okay? Let me just break down the word game. All game is, is a strategy. You know what I'm saying? But there's two types of strategy that uh, dudes will, you know, use. And this all depends on the type of women that you are interacting with. So... Um, the first way is what most dudes do, and it's basically selling yourself. You're trying to sell yourself to uh, certain women that really ain't interested in you in the first place. So you have to go on a whole bunch of dates. You got to spend $200 out of your bank account. Um, you got to, you just got to do a whole bunch of stuff. You know, you got to do a whole lot, a whole lot. You know what I'm saying? And motherfuckers ain't talking. Motherfuckers ain't got time for all that shit. You know what I'm saying? You know, you know what I'm saying, right? Yeah, you know what I'm saying, man. So that's why when I hear a lot of other dudes, you know, saying how they run game and everything, or I just, I'm just seeing it from ops. Uh, 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 observing these niggas you know what i'm saying i just peep out certain things like that like the dudes they're always talking about they got a whole bunch of girls i got i got 15 girls in rotation for the uh weekend and everything y'all gotta be cautious of them type of niggas you know what i'm saying because if you got 15 girls for one weekend or even a week then you have to be going through, like, you got to be cold approaching a lot of women to the point where I have to question if you even, like, got a job or anything. Like, what are you doing with your time? You know what I'm saying? So, just be wary of them type of dudes that be telling you all that. Um, it's kind of understandable if they got, you know, they making online money and everything. Their time isn't tied down to even uh, a job or something. But even then, you still need time to come up with content. You know what I'm saying? So it still don't make no sense. Okay, so that's the first style game where you have to sell yourself to get women or to uh, keep them interested in you or um, basically that. You know what I'm saying? So... The second point is uh you are the game. You know what I'm saying? And when I say when I say that, I'm basically saying um they're already interested in you. They're not interested in the shoes that you're wearing. They're not interested in just your swag. They're not interested in that shirt that you got on because it's Nike. Um, they're not interested in you because you driving and pushing a, you know, a V8 2019 Camaro with dual twin exhaust, 355 horsepower on the V6. But, you know, this V8, so a nigga had to upgrade and shit. 
you know what I'm saying? So that motherfucker pushing about 550 horsepower, but you know, nobody's counting. You know what I'm saying? But she's not getting with you because of none of those things. You are what she's attracted to. You know what I'm saying? Let me look y'all niggas in y'all eyes. No homo out this bitch. But uh, check it out. You are what sh she's attracted to. You know, it's your aura. It's your energy. You understand what I'm saying? Nobody's talking about that. You know what? That's actually a good video. Uh, I don't think I told you guys about scent. I told you guys about hair, but I haven't told you guys about scent. And you know, there's a lot of females that got that scent game down. You know what I'm saying? They got that down. So that's something that I learned from females is about scent and everything. And I was put on to that and you know, I delved more into that so I can break that down and see why it's working and everything. And I'm like, oh, shit, okay. I got that down now. You know what I'm saying? But that's basically all it is. If you are the game, you let the game come to you. You don't force a whole bunch of stuff. You just let the things happen naturally. It's just like uh, trying to grow a tree. You got dudes who will go buy the tree already um, pre-made or, or everything, but it's fake. Um, it may not have grown right. It's out of season. But if you're doing it right and you let everything just work how it works, all you got to do is just plant that damn seed. And you can see yourself as the damn seed. You know what I'm saying? And... Everything else takes place. The seed starts to grow roots into the ground, build a basis. Then it starts to stem up out of the ground. And then it starts growing into a damn tree. And then it starts producing fruits off the branches and everything. And then it starts going into a cycle, creating more trees and fruits and all types of shit. You know what I'm saying? Let it in the game come to you, nigga. You know what I'm saying? So... When you hear dudes talking about you got to go approach 100 girls a day so you can go get three, I can't, I, that doesn't register in my mind. Because, nigga, I am the gay. You know what I'm saying? That's the kind of mind state y'all need to uh, try to hold on to. And if you ain't there, don't try to search outside of yourself for materialistic things. It's more of an inside thing. You know what I'm saying? So, those are two styles of game. I want y'all to just be aware of the two. And just, if you're going to do that, if you're going to do the first one I was saying, then understand what may, what you're doing. You're selling yourself. So, that's not a uh, powerful or a good situation to be in. You know what I'm saying? When you're doing it the second way, everything is a lot more balanced. You don't have to force no no types of situations or anything. Man, my nose getting clogged up. All right, y'all, I had to blow my nose real quick because uh, I can notice my voice changing. It's because I couldn't breathe out my nose, you know what I'm saying? But uh, back to getting hoes. <laughs> Check it out, right? So, basically, that's what it is, man. If you want a more balanced, successful, um, interaction with women, put, put down trying to sell yourself. That's what salesmen do. And what do people think of salesmen? Y'all niggas looking on YouTube for game. You know what I'm saying? So, now that you know this... Just try to, you know, apply this to what you um trying to do. You know what I'm saying? And make sure you watch uh How to Spot a Transsexual. And I just threw up another video. So y'all can see how they trying to deceive y'all. So if y'all out here trying to sell y'all self, y'all don't sell y'all self to these motherfucking trannies. And let me just say something else. Another reason 
is another reason is cause um trannies might find you attractive when you do cold approach and do that first way of trying to sell yourself they act they might actually find you attractive and you think it's a woman and you trying to get the number and everything and you go back to your place with her and you ain't checking and you infatuated with her looks and every with his looks and everything and then she pulled down a he pulled down his drawers and you see uh snake in the cage action and you like oh but she still looks so fine look at that ass you know that's what y'all niggas doing okay don't you don't have to get to that certain situation um if you you know you're not doing that style of game but you know man it's just a more relaxed peaceful um interaction with women when you not like cold approaching and doing all this extra stuff trying to sell yourself okay when you let the game and just let just let everything just happen naturally it it works out a lot better and you start to have more pleasant um interactions with women instead of um more negative because you you cut down on flakes drastically and uh, a lot of those things that you guys be complaining about women a lot of that stuff cuts down you know what I'm saying it ain't gonna be as many women as you would be uh, approaching you know what I'm saying but the one the the um the girls you are interacting with um you're not really going to need as many women. You might not need more than one woman. Depending on the women at the par particular time that you're uh, interacting with them. You know what I'm saying? So, it's all based on you. There, there's no really, there's not really a rule on how many women you're supposed to have. But I'm going to tell you one thing. The more that you have, the more of a headache you got on your motherfucking hands. You did. The first style of game is you selling yourself and you're going to just do a lot more stuff to get the same results that you would get of just, you know, send back, letting the game come to you and just making sure yourself is in an attractive state to uh, pull women. You know what I'm saying? And once you start pulling women, you're going to start noticing the interactions a lot better you know what i'm saying so that's really the main thing i want to push into your uh your mind and your subconscious so y'all can stop being infatuated by other people on youtube uh especially them niggas over there doing that pua shit uh having you think they approaching 100 women a day uh them niggas paying women to have positive reactions to them so you know, y'all didn't hear that shit from me. Nigga, why you here? Go ahead and hit that uh like button, the subscribe button, you know, so you can keep getting this uh this deeper level and advanced level of game because you know as I look over my older videos, I'm like, dang, this is good stuff right here, but I've learned so much more. I've learned so much more. So much. So I'm going to start burning that. Okay. So this was a nice little conversation that we had. But uh, nigga, I'm done. So go ahead. Check the description link out. <laughs> Not the description link. The, the description of this video. Uh, go ahead and leave a comment. If you had any similar experiences or anything. Uh, maybe you just had a good day. Just write down. Nigga, I had a good day. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, I'll check y'all out in the next video. Alright? Let me know what y'all think. Alright, y'all. I'll see y'all later.